Hello friends, uh, this lecture is all about types of attacks in cryptography. So here we have drawn three columns that is attack, what kind of attack and what threat it proposes to the security goals. So let me first make you understand about what kind of attack. So there are basically two types of attacks, uh, passive attack and active attack. In passive attack, the intruder can only observe it can it cannot make any modification whereas in active attack it can the intruder can make changes in the any sort of message sender is uh, sending to receiver or receiver is sending to the sender all right so this is all about what is active and what is passive attack now security goals so there are basically three security goals that is uh, integrity confidentiality and availability so what integrity is that it is assurance of accuracy and consistency of a data throughout uh, throughout its lifetime it means that if i am sending a data to any receiver the data should remain in the exact format with the receiver in the format which i have sent to him all right that is all about integrity now confidentiality so confidentiality is that the information stored on the system is protected against any kind of unauthorized activity or unauthorized person that is confidentiality now let us come to availability so availability is it ensures that data continues to be available at a required level whenever we want to so this was all about uh, security goals now let us try and understand the attacks so the first attack is snooping attack or it is also known as release of message content this is a passive attack because in this attack intruder would only be able to observe he would not be able to make any changes so in snooping if a sender is sending uh, any message to the receiver then the intruder would only be able to read the message that what it is he won't be able to do anything so it is a passive attack and as i told you the definition it threads the security goal of confidentiality now another attack is traffic analysis so traffic analysis is again sort of snooping itself but in traffic analysis we would also be knowing that where the message is coming from where the message is going to and what the message is all these things an intruder would be able to analyze so it is again also a passive attack and again it will be a threat to confidentiality itself another attack is modification now as i told you in the definition itself that any kind of change you are able to make in the message it is active attack so the name modification itself suggests that it is an active sort of attack in modification the intruder would be able to make any sort of changes he wants to and this attack would be a threat to security goal integrity if you remember the definition right now another attack is masquerading so in masquerading the intruder would try to gain as much as much privileged access to the system computer as he can or we can say it as unauthorized access so it is also a kind of active attack and it will again be a threat to security goals only another is replay in this the intruder what he would be doing is that if a sender is sending a message the intruder will, will fetch it from the between and it will keep on repeating and throwing those messages to the uh, receiver to infinite amount he will be just uh, doing it replaying the message again and again again and again again and again so that is also uh, an active attack and it will be again a goal to a uh, threat to security goal integrity another is repudiation in this uh, attack what intruder would be doing is again from the between he will fetch the data and either he could send the data to receiver or does not send the data to receiver so in this the problem arises is that the receiver states that i have uh, got i have not got the data but the sender will say that i have sent because sender has officially sent the data the change what have happened is in the between what intruder has done so this kind of 
denying of sending and receiving message uh, happens in repudiation type of attack it is again active and the threat is to integrity the last is denial of service which is uh, famously known as dos it, it is also an active attack and threat to integrity in denial of service the intruder will keep on throwing as much request to the uh, receivers or the senders server that that their server comes down falls down and their services stops so this kind of uh, things is included in denial of service and which is an active attack and threat to integrity so this was all about types of attack what are the two types of attacks and what are security goals thank you